For many of these horses, every meal in recent days seems memorable. The majority of the herd knows what it's like to go without food and water for days, maybe weeks. Mostly it's malnourishment. We get them in there um, two, three hundred pounds underweight sometimes. Gina Caglia has been rescuing horses on her sprawling foothill ranch in Tyvee Valley since 2008. Half of the horses enjoying the green grass in the pasture come from SPCAs in Fresno, Madera and Merced counties. They were either abandoned or their owners couldn't care for them any longer. My phone is ringing. It used to be I'd get one, two, three calls a week. Now I get one, two, three calls a day sometimes, you know. Um, and it's just, it's crazy. Silverwings Horse Ranch is a nonprofit organization that relies on donations to keep the horses fed. Dottie Mazarek is a volunteer and a contributor to Silverwings. I've seen Gina take horses in that are just incredibly um, thin and malnourished and with love and care, vet care, you know, tender loving care. She turns them into, you know, horses that are adoptable that people are so happy to have. Recently, veterinarian Dr. Lauren DeRock joined the Silver Wings team. Her mission is to find what's ailing the horses and find ways to treat and rehabilitate them. Oh, I love it. This is a wonderful place of good vibes. And uh, they're doing holy work here. It's, it's, it's great. Gina Caglia and her husband Tony have nursed many sick horses back to good health. Hi, honey. This is Ruger. He's been here about, about a month and a half, two months, and um, he's going to be available for adoption soon. <laughs> Since 2008, Silver Wings has adopted out 51 horses, but the rescue ranch is at capacity, and chances are the waiting list will only get longer.